back, y'all. We are back at it again. Taking y'all shopping with me. So I'm trying to look for some weight storage plates that I can put on my rack. Um, I have four. I like them, but I was looking for some to storage my change plate. So I don't need them that long. Oh, there you go. So that's what I was looking for. That rogue monster. No, not for 50 bucks. So let's create our own. 10 bucks right here. Go to Home Depot. Knock it out. Uh, this is the one I was talking, or these are the four that I was talking about that I currently have. Uh, probably five years I've had them. Pretty solid. No issues. Um, like I said, I didn't need it that long and to hold that much weight. So I decided to create my own. So carriage bolts, that's all you need. Nuts, washers. The PVC uh, tubing is just to cover the thread and you're done. Uh, save yourself some money. Uh, $50 for all those other ones. This is a DIY, 10 bucks. I mean, you can even customize it. I've seen some people you know, use um, black piping over some of them, uh, I think 10 inches that, it, it, that they bought. Um, that it extended to so whatever fits you it's your gym it's your rack do what you want but this is me and this is what I ultimately decided to do um, not the most aesthetic but um, definitely functional for my purposes so here you go there you go uh, you get extra length uh, without the extra washer so keep that in mind fellas um, go ahead and shove that tube in there um, what am I talking about here? Oh yeah, so go ahead and put that in so you can protect the thread. Uh, your plates will be protected from the thread. Cut it with the razor, pretty easy. And let's see how many of these cast iron 45 plates we can fit on here. Whatever plates you got, it's gonna depend. If you got bumpers, you're probably not gonna fit as many in. For me, I got about three of these guys and it's flush right on the edge. So, Will I be using it for this? No. Why am I doing this? For the video. There you go. But, and this is not where I'm gonna ultimately um, position or locate uh, this bolt. But again, just wanted to show y'all um, max capacity as far as weight. If you got a 100 pounder, you probably put a 100 pounder in there. But this is where I ultimately decided to put it. Uh, so I got four. It was around 45 bucks each. Uh, what is today? February 2022. So people of the future, uh, depending on, I guess, you know, what the cost is. But for me, um, divided by four, you know, about 11, 12 bucks. I, I just rounded 10. 10 bucks each, not bad. Uh, comes close when I'm benching, but not enough to where it's going to alarm me. So save some money.